Some challenging things about living in Red Lodge would be finding something to do and just getting out of the house because there's always snow. And if you don't ski or snowboard or play sports, you can't really do much. But if you come to the Roosevelt, you can find something to do. There's painting, there's artwork that you can look at, there's festivals of trees, they always have something going on here that you can involve yourself in. The wind carries memories to where I don't know. I started doing theater when I was 13 years old with a little town theater called the Union County Theater Company. And since then, I've just, it, it hooked me right in at age 13 and I've never stopped loving it. I think Heroes Steam can help kids around Carbon County to find new ways to do stuff and like maybe help them find really cool things that they want to be when they grow up and what like computers can do with them and they might even find it to be their best talent. Kat Healy, director of the Roosevelt Center here in Red Lodge, Montana. I'm standing in front of a mural done by Gracie Andrews, who is our youth intern here at Roosevelt. Gracie spent more than 200 hours putting together this piece of art. We strive to have an open, welcoming environment where youth can come in, express themselves, and have a place here in the center of our community. We would love to have more youth in the building so that they can create new pieces of artwork, do theater, enjoy maker spaces like Hero Steam, anything we can do to engage the next generation of youth. In the land of the mountains where summer sees snow. I want to be a marine biologist when I'm older. I inspired to be a marine biologist because I grew up on the coast my whole life and I've always loved ocean life and just the animals, the plants that have to do with it. I think the Roosevelt Center helped me because I get to work with other people and you don't really do much of that in school and I get a taste of like the real world and everything that's going on with it. Kids in Carby County have so many opportunities, but we've never had a place where we could really explore the arts, whether it be painting or clay or steam or drama or piano or dance. We now have that place, and I'm hoping that the kids of Carbon County are gonna come flocking in here and say, oh my gosh, I found a home for what I want to do. To the woman who knows me and holds me post war, seen me stand on a mountain and cry on the floor. To the things that we have and we have yet to hold, these are the places I'm from that I go. These are the places I'm from that I go. These are the places I'm from. That